All right, I'm going to do final board assembly. Uh, since the last video, I got the LEDs put in. Uh, if you haven't seen the other videos, I've got all these modifications done. Uh, everything's jumpered in, uh, ready to go together. Uh, I did go through and also put a dab of uh, high temp hot glue on a lot of these nuts. I was a little worried they'd fall off or something. So they have lock washers on some of them, but I just didn't have a good feeling about it. So put a little bit of hot glue on there and uh, also this modified wire over here I hot glued in place so um, that should be about it uh, I also, if you're watching these in order, I did figure out the spare one, spare two issue for can high and can low uh, I've been kind of switching between manuals, there's the mega manual uh, for mega squared two, it's kind of the official bowling and grippo um, manual, that's the guys that designed this board uh, and did the original software. I also have been using the MS Extra manual uh, that's very good uh, but sometimes it leaves out some of the detail that the Mega Manual has in it um, pinouts and stuff like that. The, the MS Extra stuff just kind of a to the point trying to uh, get you going I guess so every now and then it's worth cruising over to the Mega Manual and checking out reading it also uh, lots of reading to do so anyway, jumper those guys over to uh, JS6 and JS8 is where they go. So down here, you can jumper just right over to um, where these spares come in under the map sensor, or you can go around the board, um, come up and jumper them in on top. Either way, but anyway, so these guys come in um, together. I haven't actually test fitted this with my heat sink modification just yet. It's kind of a tight fit here. Let's slide extrusion slides right in. And then the top essentially just fits on. Uh, it's keyed though. This end will go on here. That'll be the finished unit. I got case screws that came with the kit, and that's about it. Ready to put in the car. 